Okay, we're here at 476 South Spalding Drive here in Beverly Hills. Now, we're here to check the main sewer line. We obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. You'll have your general inspector run the water everywhere, check whatever he can. We're here to check the main line, and this inspection is based on my opinion. So I can tell you that we started off by running the camera from this four-inch clean-out located here where the gas meter is. The sewer line goes all the way down the hill to the alley in the back where it goes through the property. It's got a very good grade going downhill. And um, we have our camera in the line. We're all the way out to the city connection in the alley. Apparently, there's an alley back there. You can see the city sewer flowing by there. So we're going to bring the camera back here. Now, looks like we have a cured-in-place pipe lining um, coming back from the middle of the alley towards the property. This is a six-inch lining that appears to be in good condition as of today. And then it comes back onto the property with ABS plastic over here. And apparently the homeowner says there's two clean-outs on the hillside over there back to back. So as it comes back with a plastic pipe, this is all in good condition. Go forward, go forward, let me look at the coupling. Okay, so that looks like a, a polyethylene pipe that's obviously been fused. So this is all in good condition. It's a nice polyethylene pipe coming back over here, all in good condition. sewer line has a very good grade going downhill. Now there's another four inch cured in place pipe lining over here as it runs back all the way and this lining is in good condition as of today. Now one thing I'm, I want to stress uh, that if you ever do have a blockage in the line you never want to run a cable with a blade through a lining because you can cut it up and destroy it. It should always be cleaned with a hydrojetter very carefully. Now the lining is in good condition um, as of today. Okay, here it's going to come out of the clean out over here. Okay, I'm going to pause the recording here. Okay, it comes out of the clean out. Yeah, by the gas meter over here. We're going to pause the recording. We're going to go to another clean out that's sticking out of the wall of the house. Okay, we're running the camera from the three inch clean out here, uh, sticking out of the wall. Okay, and we're at the other clean out. That we'll run our camera from. There's two four inch clean outs here on the outside of the house. Okay, bring the camera back. This is a clay pipe here. This all looks pretty good. Now remember, we obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. Comes back to some ABS plastic over here as it's going to take a turn. And then go underneath the house. Now this cast iron is definitely getting a little older. There's no doubt that the cast iron is definitely a little older. Now it's, it's impossible to check every pipe in the house. So you're going to have to be very careful what you're flushing down the toilets. No tampons, baby wipes, paper towels, things like that. You may need some periodic cleaning and stuff. But obviously the cast iron pipe is getting a little old. Uh, no doubt about that. We're going to pause the recording again. Okay, running the camera from the 4-inch clean-out outside here. We reached the original 4-inch clean-out by the gas meter. There it is right over there. So we're going to bring the camera back. So we have some... So we have some clay piping outside of here that appears to be in good condition. There's no roots or anything getting into it. Okay, here we come out of the clean out here. We'll pause the recording again. 
Okay, we're running the camera here from the clean out. If you by the front door on the left hand side where the homeowner says they never clean the line, we flushed the toilet over there. You can see the toilet over here. Keep coming back. The cast line, come back slowly. You can see the cast line is very old, this cast line piping. You can see the heavy rust buildup in it over here. It's very difficult getting our camera through over here. Uh, so this cast iron piping underneath this house is extremely old. Um, you may want to consider trying to run a cable with a blade through there to hopefully descale it. Hopefully that could work. Otherwise, uh, the cast iron eventually is going to need to be replaced. It's very old and we'll stop the recording over here.